Okay, so now we get to go through the Joyful Heart, Romancing Your Soul with Aromatherapy, Blessings and Blends book. So in the beginning, when I originally created the recipe books, there was a separate recipe book for each of the 15 modules. That became very expensive, and I wanted to give you the best deal I could give you. So we actually compiled all the recipes into one book so that now you have one book that has all, there's about 72 blends for emotional clearing. So how would I use this book? As you can see, this looks a lot like the CD phases on the Heaner's Touch. So these next pages are the blessings, the affirmations that you can use on yourself if you wanted to do a little reading for the morning, a morning devotional, and on the back of the page is the oil with all of the ingredients to create that oil. The oils are the names of the songs. So I'm going to test Anita because we did the Healer's Touch session and because we want her to experience a blend. We're going to test and say, okay, Anita, which one of the songs and scents is your body testing for? Okay, so we're going to muscle test for that. Permission to test circuits in the clear. And we can go through one page at a time. Here is sense of peace. So she's testing for the sense of peace blend. Do you feel that? Mm -hmm. Sense of peace. Let's see if there's anything else. Magic kisses. Do you see how that, do you feel that difference? Mm -hmm. Pretty obvious. I didn't change my strengths, did I? Sorrow into song. That's testing strong. Saying that the ingredients in this oil are something that Anita's brain, mind, heart, spirit could work with. And also that reading the intention would assist in emotional clearing. Childlike faith, that's testing strong. you feel that? Okay, so we could read her that one. Flaming sore, is it testing strong? Pure love, that one breaks. Forgiving heart, that one breaks. Sweet surrender, breaks. And then we end with divine essence. So we tested for sense of peace, and magic kisses. Sense of peace and magic kisses. So in these little blends, I already have them made. Let's see if we have sense of peace. And so you would just follow the little recipe on the back of your book. You can contact me if you want these labels or if you want to create your own labels, that's fine. Uh, the thing I like about the doTERRA bottles is that if it leaks oil, you can't, it doesn't botch up the label and so far this does is not smudge proof so you have to be really careful so that you don't have oil leakage that that kind of obscures the writing or obscures the label so I'd like to find some labels that are better for that but anyway I'll have Anita bring breathe in that oil now these oils are very very they're delicate my daughters call them purely organic perfumes and how do you like that Anita I like it a lot. <laughs> it's really fresh and lilting and uplifting. Could you see yourself wearing that as perfume? Mm -hmm. And knowing that it is doing emotional clearing, just as she wears her emotional clearing oil, and she's actually, because the name on the bottle is the same as the name on the song, her brain is conditioning itself. Oh, there's my sense of peace. Breathing in my sense of peace. Mm -hmm. And she's conditioning her mind, linking the thought I have a sense of peace. I am a sense of peace with this blend. And it's, it's communicating with the limbic centers of her brain. Okay, now we're going to, I think it was magic kisses. But I can test for that. Like, uh, wasn't sweet surrender. Wasn't forgiving heart. I think it was magic kisses. It was sorrow in the song. Mm -hmm. Let's muscle test her for that. I'm going to have her hold that oil. We're going to say, was this the oil because I forgot because I didn't write it down? And that's the oil. That matches. That is really strong. Can you feel that? <laughs> that says to me that Anita's mind would work really good with the song and scent method. That her brain is saying, yeah, I would like some song with that scent. It's like saying, I'd like some salt with that pepper. Just give it to me in, in more ways and tell me how you feel about this oil. Mm -hmm. That's really good. This is sorrow into song. 
These are fresh oils. And I have to tell you, it's really interesting, but the way that I came up with these blends was I prayed. And I asked for the gift of blending. And when I sat down to blend, I had all of my doTERRA oils all over my coffee table. And I had all my little bottles and I had eyedroppers, one for each of the doTERRA oils so I wasn't mixing my eyedroppers. And I had a little piece of tape around every single eyedropper that said balance, serenity, white fur, every single oil had its own eyedropper. And um, I sat there and I said, okay, angels tell me what to do. And then it was just like hearing inaudibly this three drops of this. Oh, we're making sense of peace. Okay, three drops of this, six drops of that. And it was really a fun thing to do. Okay, I think she tested for magic kisses, but I don't remember. Okay, she did test for magic kisses. So now we're going to breathe in magic kisses. Magic kisses actually has a story behind it. When I was a little girl, age four, I loved to play outside. How do you like that blend? So of the three of them, is there a favorite? <laughs> this is really lilting. This brush and not lilting. Okay, so her favorite of all those three oils is Magic Kisses. When I was a little girl, this was actually the first blend I ever created with that name. When I was a little girl, I would go outside and I'd come in from playing and my mother would, I'd skin my knee and I'd come in and I'd be sobbing and my mother would say, I can't understand what you're saying. You need to stop crying so I can understand what you're saying. And I, I should say, okay, just point to where it hurts. So I'd point to my elbow or I'd point to my knee and my mom would say, okay, don't you know I have magic kisses? She'd kiss her finger, she'd put it on my sore elbow or she'd kiss her finger and put it on my sore knee. Mm -hmm. And she'd say, my kisses are magic, Karen. They take the pain away immediately. And pretty soon, my mother had me so conditioned that I would cry and she'd say, magic kisses, and I'd stop crying. I remember one time, I was five years old, and I remember I had climbed up our old Chevrolet, green Chevy. I climbed up it to, to impress the little boy across the street who was standing on the sidewalk. And I was climbing up it and I slid down and the license plate went right, the edge of the license plate just slit like a knife, my knee leaving a little flap and gushing blood. And as I went into the house, I was blubbering and my mother couldn't understand a word I was saying. She looked at my knee and she looked at my blood dribbling down my leg. And she said, what's the matter? And I was, ah! and I couldn't explain. And finally she said, I know what you need. You need magic kisses. And immediately I stopped crying and she said, how do you do that? How do you just stop crying just like that? And I looked at her and I said, don't you know? You got magic kisses. <laughs> and so my first oil that I ever created was magic kisses. Because as I was praying one night when I was 28, I was really sad. I was going through a really hard part of my marriage. And it didn't look like it was turning out very well. And I was praying, and I couldn't explain how I felt. All I knew was that I was feeling grief and sadness and broken dreams, and this isn't going the way I planned. And this isn't what I dreamt a happy marriage was supposed to be like when I was a little girl. And as I was kneeling there, the words came to my mind. Do you remember when your mom asked you to point to where it hurts? Just point to where it hurts. Because I couldn't even express it. The pain was so deep and so interrelated and interconnected. And I pointed to my mind and I pointed to my heart. And then the words came to my mind. Karen, the Savior's love is like a magic kiss. And I can take the pain away immediately. That was when I was 28. And when I was in my 40s and I created my first blend, I knew the name had to be Magic Kisses in honor of that atonement of Jesus Christ that takes the pain away immediately. Okay, we're going to do a demonstration here of ankle testing. We have Linda, and you can see what you're doing when you're doing ankle testing is you're trying to see if those ankle bones line up. And your client can usually feel when their ankle bones are lined up. And I'm gonna ask Linda, Linda, can you feel if your ankle bones feel lined up or if one leg feels longer or shorter than the other? 
And can you tell me which one it is? Because the people in the audience can see what I'm, what I'm seeing. Okay, do you feel like they're lined up? I feel like they're pretty lined up right now. Okay, the people on the, on the audience can see that they're not lined up. This bone is actually higher, which means that this leg is actually shorter. And if you can see that, it's just a little bit off. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna do muscle testing. We're gonna find out which one of these oils in the Healer's Touch method brings her body back into balance or groupings of oils. And all I have to do is put an oil on her tummy, okay? Okay, that didn't do it, so lay that to your side. Now we have wild orange, oh actually wild orange isn't in the Heater's Touch set, so we're not going to use that one today. Sorry wild orange. This one is Citrus Bliss. Okay, ladies, do you see what just happened? Though, Linda, can you feel what just happened? Mm-hmm, yeah. Okay, now you will even feel kind of a magnetism. You may even feel a suction cup. When the body wants this oil, it's gonna, you're gonna feel a good, strong lock. That is a lock. So Linda, can you feel that? Mm-hmm. Okay, would you take that oil and put it to the side? Okay, we're gonna see if when we put Ylang Lang on, if it stays lined up, if the body wants Ylang Lang. Okay, in it, what does it feel like? It feels off a little bit. Yep, it's off. So put your Lang Lang on your right side. Here's Purify. Okay, what does that feel like? Off. Actually, Linda. Is it on? It's looking completely on. Good. <laughs> so put Purify on your right side, I mean on your left side. Okay. Here you go with Whisper. Mm -hmm. Okay, that, that is off. Okay. Okay. Terra Shield, guess what? This leg just went off and went shorter. So now this leg, the bone is down. The ankle bone is down further than that leg. Okay, so Terra Shield, no. And this is very slight, but you'll get comfortable doing this. And it's really nice. It's a nice way of muscle testing because they don't have to do any of the work. They just get to lay there. This is Serenity. How does that one feel, Linda? Feels Pretty good. Yep, that one's right yeah. on. So put that one over there. Now we're doing elevation. And how does that one feel? Pretty good. That is beautiful. Mm -hmm. That is perfect. Can you see that? Viewing audience, that is perfect. Okay. And here is balance. How does that feel? That might be pretty on. Okay, it is pretty on. So I want you to take all five of those oils that you tested strong for, lay them on your stomach. Now, Joy Coach's glass is a conductor, so it's like we're just putting all of that oil in her auric field space. We want to know, is this too much? Does her body even want the dynamics of all of these synergies and these blends? Let's see. It's perfect. Right on. How does that feel, Linda? Good. Okay, I want you to take those and lay them to that side and pick up all the ones that your body didn't test for and let's lay those on your stomach and let's see what we get when we put all of the oils. Now she tested for five oils, five oils that worked and we've got wild orange in there that isn't supposed to be in there. So let's find wild orange and take it out. Okay, so we've got four oils Okay, and what do you feel? It feels out of balance. Okay, viewing audience, joy coaches, do you see that those, this bone is lower than this bone? And that is off. Okay, so now we know Linda's body does not want those, those particular oils. Linda's body is testing for these five. Linda, let's have you read to me what oils your body's testing for. Elevation, Balance, Serenity, Purity, 
and citrus bliss. Purify, right? Oh, purify, yes. Purify, mm -hmm. okay. Mm -hmm. So now we're gonna do, would you be willing to do the arm test to see if it tests the same? Yes, I will do it. Okay, let's do that. And also we're gonna do the, the personal testing. You could test like this, where if it's a strong test, it holds the link, and if it's a break, it just slides through. So for instance, I can muscle test myself this way. So whisper is testing strong for me. I can't even break it. And so that's where I hold the oil. It's just my little oil holder right there. Just hold, hold the oil, I can't break that. Okay, I don't need Terra Shield. And so those of you who have been saying, hey, how can I do this? This is one way of doing it. Just holding the oil, and I am testing for your Lang Lang. So on and so forth. That one is frankincense. I'm not testing for frankincense today. Not testing for wild orange today. It's the imposter. It keeps sneaking into our healer's <laughs> touch kit. It's actually in Divine Essence 4904. And it just wanted to come and play today. I know how these it's oils work. Oil. <laughs> it is. It's wild. And it just shows up. Okay. So, Linda, we're going to test you for what oils your body is wanting. Permission to test. Circuits in the clear. You always state it like that. Permission to test. Yes. Circuits in the clear. Yes. Body willing to access what is most wanted and needed energetically and vibrationally now. Yes. Okay. I'm not going to look Linda in the eye while I do the muscle testing mm -hmm. because that creates a shift. I do brace her shoulder and I don't crank on her arm. Just so this is when you're practicing. This is how you're going to do it. Okay. Okay. So I'm going to have Linda hold the oil. She can hold it over her heart. Just holding it in her hand is good, but Linda's going to hold elevation over her heart. And that is a strong test. Linda is going to hold Purify over her heart. And that is a strong test. Linda's holding Ylang Ylang over her heart. And that breaks. Linda's holding our favorite, my favorite, Wild Orange. But it breaks. Today, is not what Linda's body is. It's not the energy that her body's asking for. What is that one? That one is Terra Shield. Okay, Terra Shield is a no. Citrus Bliss is a yes. <laughs> and one of my favorites, Serenity. How does that feel? Strong, very strong. Serenity is a strong. Strong one, testing for frankincense today, frankincense test week today, testing for balance, balance test strong. Now let's say that we are going, Linda's going to have a healer's touch session and her body just tested for these oils, okay? She didn't test for all of them. It's okay to let her breathe in these other oils. She just doesn't really want them. Put At the moment, oh, can you, is that yeah. going to work for you? Mm -hmm. Now we're going to test for the dynamic and the synergy of this grouping. Mm. Out of a scale of 1 to 10, let's find out if there's any other oil, because we're only testing for Healer's Touch, but let's see if there's any other oil that wants to come and play today. No other oil. This is the perfect blend for Linda. We can go so far as to, by the way, when you start working with your Joyful Heart recipe book, all of these oils are in all of those blends, in those Healer's Touch blends. So this is a strong test for Linda. On a scale of 0 to 10, 10 being the highest and what is most wanted. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Mm -hmm. And that is a lock. <laughs> Can't budget, can I? No. She is strong. <laughs> okay, Linda, we want you to practice on me, okay? All right. Let's just have you practice with... Balance. Let's see if balance is a strong one. Okay, first you hold that. Okay. First of all, ask circuits yes. in the clear. Okay. Circuits in the clear. That's strong. Body willing to access the truth. Body willing to access the truth. That's a strong. Yes, it is. Okay. okay. So we're going to find out if my body is needing some balance today. Okay. Does Karen's body need some balance today? No. Okay, let's find out 
I want to go with frankincense because okay. I want some frankincense today. Uh, okay, is is frankincense? Is this what Karen would want today? Karen's body, frankincense. Oh, what is it now? Frankincense. frankincense. Yes, it is strong. Okay. okay. So now we're going to ask: Is this just my body want this on the outside or internally? Oh. Okay. Externally or internally? Okay, just Karen. Either one. Thank you, Kent. <laughs> <laughs> Does Karen's body want? It wants it everywhere. inside, outside, upside down. Okay. Does Karen's body want this internally? Yes. Does Karen's body want this externally? Yes. Both. Okay. I have to tell you that I just recently found a recipe for frankincense water, and it's really fascinating. We can do with the essential oils. It basically said put the rosin of frankincense in water and let it distill overnight. Just let it sit out on the wow. kitchen counter and, and then just sip it during the day. And that it's really super good for balancing your immune system. So that is fun. I'm going to be drinking my frankincense water today, but I'll be adding drops of this. Let's find out how many drops of this I need today. Okay. In my water. Okay, permission to test how many drops that Karen needs is in her water. Okay. One, two, three is strong. And is that three. one time a day or more than one time a day? Okay, is it one time a day? Yes, it's one so time a day. So I just need three drops. Well, let's just skip the water. Let's do it right here and right now. <laughs> That's wonderful. Let it go in under the tongue, sublingually. Mm. Mm, gotta love that frankincense. Definitely. So you can be very specific about what oils you're using, what oils you're internalizing what oils you're ingesting, what oils you're using. And in your Healer's Touch method book, talks about a belly button technique because you have six to 7,000 nerve endings in your belly button. If you put the oil in your belly button, it will travel, the intelligence of your body just is like a rapid transit system and says, oh, we need some frankincense down there in the lower regions. We need some up there in the brain. We need some over here in the heart. Or we need some throughout the entire immune system. So thank you. If you have any more questions on muscle testing, rewind this video.